I'm going to do a really quick tutorial on how to set up your 8-bit Do remote with Anki. So the first thing we're going to do is connect the remote to the computer. So what you're going to do is press down Start and R at the same time. Once it does that, you're going to hold down the Select button. Once it starts blinking like that, you're going to open up your Bluetooth settings on your laptop. If it shows as a keyboard, then you want to connect. If it shows as like a controller or anything else, remove that, turn this off and reconnect it until you see it pop up as a keyboard. So this is the software that I use to map my keys. So when you download the app, you're going to see two apps pull up. There's a thing called Carabiner Event Viewer and Carabiner Elements. The elements is the one that you want to select and click target device and click the 8-bit do remote. So when you download this for the first time, this is going to be empty, but I've already mapped all my keys as you can see. All you're going to do is press add items and start mapping your keys. So the reason why we're doing this is because each of the buttons on this remote is already pre-programmed to a certain key on your keyboard. So I put up a picture of what each button is already pre-programmed to. And with this app, you can change the button to whatever key you actually want it to be. So this is a picture of what I mapped my buttons to and a little tip for when your Anki remote disconnects and it will disconnect like a bajillion times what you have to do is go on your Bluetooth settings remove your keyboard and you're just gonna redo the setup so turn off your remote by pressing down the start button and it will turn off and then you're going to redo everything so press the start and R button once press select once it starts blinking like that you're gonna go to your bluetooth settings and it should pop up again and once again you only want to connect it if it shows up as a keyboard like this and connect and it's connected so apito sent me a couple of these remotes so i'm going to do a little giveaway and if you want to win one of these remotes, I'm going to have instructions on the bottom. Please enter the giveaway because I have like three people watching this video and I have a lot of remotes. So yeah, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you later. Bye.